working. Without Sheldon, most of us would have never met, but Penny would still live across from him. And with Leonard out of the picture, we all know what that would mean. We do? Hey, Sheldon. Hello. Doing laundry? <laughs> Of course I'm doing laundry. Saturday night is laundry night, and I'm in a laundry room, so I believe your inference is justified. <laughs> My inference is justified. Sheldon, you are so funny. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I need to do my laundry, too, because these clothes are so dirty. Almost as dirty as the dirty girl who's wearing them. <laughs> OK, that's enough. Disagree. Keep going. <laughs> so, what do you think? A tad asymmetrical, but nothing to be concerned about. Hey, Sheldon, I need you. To what? <laughs> to take me. I'm not taking you anywhere till you put on a shirt. <laughs> Come on, Sheldon. You and me, right here. Penny for the thousandth time. I'm saving myself for someone special. You know, perhaps a cute, bespectacled neuroscientist with hair the color of mud. I think I know how to change your mind. That's Ooh. enough. <laughs> I was okay with it. How's it going, Sheldon? Actually, much better. Oh, good. Is the baby born yet? I don't know. I just got back. Where'd you go? My mother asked me to get some towels. I took advantage of the vague request and went to Bed Bath & Beyond. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm on the phone! <laughs> so rude. Here's another one. Penny, if it weren't for Sheldon, you never would have met comic book legend, Stan Lee. Great. <laughs> well, at least Leonard, Howard, and I would have always been friends. Hey, how come you three never got an apartment together? We talked about it, but Howard was in a pretty serious relationship with his mom. <laughs> I lived with her to save money. <laughs> yeah, you didn't have to buy groceries because you were breastfeeding. <laughs> I guess if it weren't for me, you'd still be living with her, huh? Not exactly. What do you mean, not exactly? Well, things would be a little different. Howard, where's my lunch? I'm starving! <laughs> I know you're starving. The neighbors know you're starving. They're starving people in Africa who know you're starving! <laughs> That's it? There's not enough food! Well, you cleaned out Earth! I don't know what else to do! <laughs> How is this any different? You didn't let me finish. Here you go, Mother. You're a good boy, Howard! Such a good boy! <laughs> Wait, did she die or did you kill her? <laughs> Tomato, tomato. The important thing is she's dead. Hey, so how come you two didn't move in together? You know, this guy wanted a place of his own because he was sure he was going to be a ladies' man. <laughs> yeah, I was wrong. <laughs> but I do think you and I would have had a great time. Come on, Leonard. Dinner. Coming. <laughs> Hang on. Why would I be fat? You'd have no girlfriend to see you naked. You'd try to fill the void with food. And I'm an enabler who wants deep fried a pancake. Why can't you be fat, too? What do you want to do for dessert? <laughs> I think there's still half a cake from breakfast. No, there's not. <laughs> Hey, guys. <laughs> what are you doing? I 
<clears throat> I just wanted to be in anyone's story. 